Yo, what's going on guys and welcome back to Jazz Reincarnation. Last episode, um, the main character found a friend, uh, which she thought it was a dude, but it was a girl, you know. I pre-fired it, I knew it was a dude. I mean, fuck, I mean, <laughs> I, mean I, I knew it was a girl. So like, you know, and then he the whole time thought it was a dude and then he started, they about to get in the bath and then he's like, the, the girl didn't want to pull down her pants cause like, you know, they, you know, they different, you know. Uh, so then he was like, and like he ended up like you know like you know hitting her with the hitting her with the juke you know pulling her pants down. And he realized no, you know it's like they don't got a, um, you know they, they, they don't got a thing. So they was like oh shit like you know I fucked up. Yeah, <laughs> but I I knew I knew it was I knew it was a, um a, a girl because they were just they wouldn't give up the right vibes to me. But you know I mean you were gonna do this episode. What's so called family emergencies? I'm I'm confused what they gonna do. Is he gonna like be like a fight or something? But well family fight obviously, but. Yeah, guys, without further ado, let's get right into the video. That's great. Oh, it's cold. Mother, you're such a sweetheart. And Wait, is she pregnant? To be an excellent big brother when this little one comes along. Oh, oh that's actually this. crazy. Oh, 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 we're overjoyed at the news. Well, <laughs> hey, I mean, they've been going crazy ever since the what the first episode. My humble apologies. On ballistics, bro. I'm afraid I'm pregnant. What? Time for. No, she cheated on me, bro. Oh no my god. No one bothered to bro. ask who the father was. Oh. Nor did anyone have Don't to. tell me it's Paul. Forgive me, Zenith. That child's it's probably mine. No. But good on him for coming clean so fast. I suppose if he's always going to lecture me about being a real man. Oh my god, bro. So, you know. That's gotta count for something. Oh but my this god. This is bro. a nightmare scenario. But but I mean, he he, he putting the city boys up, but like, come on, bro, like you you looking, you make, you're making the making people like me look bad, bro. Like he he could he could have if he at least tagged me in, I wouldn't care. But like he didn't tag me in at all. He just he just got my girl pregnant, bro. Oh my god, dude! Holy shit! Bro was going crazy with the maid. He could have at least tagged me. If he tagged me in, I wouldn't care. But did she kick him out? I wonder, I wonder how they, how they gonna do it. Uh, that is a, you know, a tough situation. Wait! What if that's the redhead girl? Cause her, what if that's the redhead girl? Cause I remember if I was a redhead girl and what if that's her daughter? Wait, did they kick her out? I'm yeah, I'm bro. Don't, don't tell me I'm fucking giga brain right now, bro. So, what will you do? After I have assisted you with childbirth, my lady, I plan to take my leave of you. You'll have to have your baby here first. Yeah. You'll be in no condition to travel. <clears throat> well, be that as it may, I have nowhere else I can turn. Zenith, sh surely she. You stay out of this. Yeah. Come on, buddy. Yeah, say, of say you have ass over there, bro. For a woman with a newborn. Of course, Zenith is conflicted. See, it, 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 it's, it's, it's why you hang with a real nigga like me. A real nigga like me. Like now, I don't cheat. So, you know. I don't want to lose her either. Even even even, even if it's a baddie going house, bro. When I got a girl, bro. I ain't like you, bro. Uh, I just got a sad sad example, bro. So when I have my kids, now me cheat on their girlfriend, bro. No. And most importantly, she knows about the holy relic. She's <laughs> kept it secret. Oh. I thought you could write him out, but you know, you're, you're saying. It's not the purse. <laughs> Mother, I thought it would be a good thing that I'm going to get two new siblings instead of just one. So why is everyone so upset? To me, it didn't sound like Lily was allowed to say no to him. What? What do you mean? It kind of sounded like father was threatening her before. What? Huh? A while ago, I got up in the middle of the night to use the bathroom, and when I passed Lilia's room, I thought I heard father say something like, spread your legs if you don't want people to find out. Rudy, what the hell are you- I said keep your mouth shut! But oh my on. god. Are you Tell kidding me? Is true? The young master must be mistaken. All father's fault. Damn. Oh yeah. I suppose. So it wouldn't be fair for her to get in so much trouble for something she didn't do, right? Well, no. 
and you know I have a lot of fun playing with Filthy every day. So don't you think it would be nice for the new baby to have a friend too? Perhaps. Yes. Damn. Don't make her leave. I don't want to say goodbye to Lelia. <laughs> Man, it, it is crazy. The the, the dad the dad you know. You went. Ah, oh, Dean. You didn't make it easy, madam. Part of the family now. It would be foolish to ask you to leave. Well, yeah, technically. Great, glad that's. Yeah, kick the dad out. Any Get the bitch-ass out of here. It's up to you, Paul. <laughs> sure hope you can handle it. This is your last chance, Senor. As for you, I hope you're prepared to have a nice long talk about all this later. I shouldn't have been spared. This pregnancy yeah. is my fault. I was the one who seduced Paul. Um. After years of hearing them carry on like that night after night, I finally reached a breaking point. Yeah. I deserve to be punished for giving in, for betraying. Oh me. my God, bro! But I was forgiven. The how happened, right? Envious made that happen. He even guided us to an elegant compromise. I've always been frightened of that child. Oh, so I've made a point of avoiding him as much as possible. What? As a baby, he used to stare at my chest with that repulsive grin. Yeah. It was unnerving. <laughs> I thought he might be possessed. Okay. But it's time I let go of that nonsense. He saved my life. And for that, he deserves my respect. Oh, yeah. If this child grows up healthy and strong, I will see to it that they make their way into Lord Rudius' service. I wonder if that can be the redhead girl, the baby. Hey there, girls. Is it Daddy or a monster? <laughs> Where Daddy what are you both girls? Every day with this. Don't you have anything better to do, Paul? <laughs> What child rearing should feel like. Things with young Master Rudius were much too easy. Oh, yeah. Darling, would you go draw some water? Yeah. Filthy. I think I have to be the cool male role model for those <laughs> girls. Huh? Well, yeah, I mean, well, yeah, your dad seemed cool, but no, he. really has actually been talking to me. It's time for practice. Let's get to work. Oh, you he's still trash. Do you want to stay elementary rank forever? <laughs> Paul may be childish, irresponsible trash, but I don't think he's rotten to the core. Mm, and despite oh, yeah. all his faults, uh, I respect his strength. Uh, there damn. are three sword Did he break styles, his sword? Sword God, Water God, and North God. Paul is advanced in all three. Uh, yeah. uh, oh, shit. Watch it, boy, that's cheating. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> you might have a little talent for magic, but your sword play is already stagnated. <laughs> Wipe that look off your face and stand up. Don't you want to grow up to be a cool guy like your old man here? I didn't think it was very cool to cheat on your wife and almost break your family. Oh heart. my god. If it bothers you to hear that, would you please keep your hands off anyone who isn't mother? What the fuck is that, bro? <laughs> I don't know. If it happens again, Mother might move back in with her family. <sighs> Come on, you're a guy. You get it. What exactly do you think a seven-year-old boy is supposed to get? <laughs> well, I know seven? you're a little silky, and you gotta admit, that girl is gonna be a total knockout when she grows up. <laughs> All right. Yeah, of course she is, but is I it? happen to think that she's super beautiful already. So you do understand. Uh, yeah, yeah. Paul's a scumbag, all right, <laughs> but we speak the same language. What am I now, 40-something? I was hot yeah. garbage in my day, too. I can't judge. Hmm? Nothing. Just that you're at an age where kids normally start attending school. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I know. You don't need it, though. You can already read, write, and do math. Well, yeah. Still. Are you feeling to go? Wanna. Are you being serious right now? <laughs> well, don't think too hard about it. Joints like that are all full of bratty nobles. A nerdy little kid from the sticks would get bullied for sure. <laughs> and 
I'll tell you something else. The girls in those places never exercised a single day in their lives. Sure, they look good on the surface. Then you get them into bed with their corsets off, and they're a total mess. Honestly, <laughs> oh, I've been tricked yeah. more times than I care to admit. That's unfortunate. I was kind of looking forward to building a harem like my dear old dad. Uh, hey, <laughs> oh, my don't God. You look at that. You're my son after all. Uh, yeah. She's going to surpass me before too long. Well, so, uh, see, well, he hitting his eye. What do you want to do today? Well, he... uh, oh, sorry. Mm -hmm. Say what? You've been acting weird again lately. <laughs> According to my parents, I've been weird since I was born. <laughs> That's what I mean. You look sad about something. I've been kind of stuck lately. I yeah. haven't made any progress with swords or magic. But you're already amazing, Rudy. I don't think this village has much to offer me anymore. <gasps> what the heck? Oh. Hey, you okay, Silphy? No. No. Please don't leave me. I don't want you to go anywhere. <laughs> well, I mean, she got to go with you, then, right? It's okay. I understand. I'll stay right here with you. And as we grow up together, I'll have plenty of time to make her my ideal woman. <laughs> okay. <laughs> hey, Rudy. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't anyone ever tell you to put like the dog first? Go oh, away. Calm down. You've got a letter. <laughs> a letter? What, from the school? Dear Rudius, I hope you and your family are well. I can't believe oh, that what's wrong with her name? We parted. And I'm pleased to say I finally right. mastered King Class Water Magic. I thought I'd reached my limit, but good old fashioned effort goes a long way. I wouldn't be surprised if you're already <laughs> casting Emperor Class Magic. I'm excited and a little nervous to see what you can do someday. And I promise to work yeah, hard. Yeah, they, they, they go on meetup, right? That makes I doubt sense. I need to worry. But if you do hit a dead end in your studies, I would urge you again to seek admission to the Renoa University of Magic. Sweet little girl is ranked all the way up to a water king. Good for her. Is that hard to do? Indescribably hard. As a matter of fact, I'd be willing to bet that you uh. could count all the active king class mages in the world on one hand. Oh, wow. Damn. But, uh, kiddo, did you really steal her panties? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Talk about a wake up call. Father, may I make kind of an unreasonable request? You may not. Yeah. Ask for anything. <laughs> I'm sure your father will manage somehow. What a cold an opportunity to actually demonstrate some paternal dignity. If you want something so crazy that he asked permission uh, just to bring uh, it up, so I'm sure it's impossible. Uh, I'm starting okay. to worry that I won't improve much more on my own. So I decided that I would like to attend the Renoa University of Magic. Oh, yeah? <laughs> but when I brought that up to Silphy, she started to cry and begged me not to leave her. Atta boy, I wonder where you learned to be such a lady killer. The ideal solution okay. would be for the two of us to enroll together, but her family isn't as well off as we are. I was hoping you could pay tuition for both of us, so please think about it. Oh, all the way to Renoa? Not a hmm. chance. <laughs> But, to make sure you understand why, first, you're still learning the sword. As your teacher, I refuse to let you quit now. In that case, may I ask for something else instead? What, a job? I would like to find a job, as well paid as possible. Huh? A job? What for? By the time you decide that I'm ready to leave home, I hope to earn Silphy's tuition all by myself. That might not be in Silphy's best interests. Maybe not. But I think it will yeah. be in mine. I mean, what job could he do? I mean, what, he like, hella young? Well, no fucking... Up, I'll see what I can do for you. I mean, what, what job could he do? I mean, he... Yeah. Uh, well, that's the job, people? I know, see, you got a horse, bro. Who was that? Oh my god. Feels like it's been forever. Who is that? It's a girl. What the hell? Madam Titty Kitty. Oh my god. Hi. Please take care of our little Rudius. Can do. Oh, he's gonna be a bounty hunter or something? Young Master Rudius. 
will miss you very much. Huh? Take care, sweetheart. We'll see you when you get back, okay? Get back from what? I'm not going anywhere. Listen. <laughs> yeah? What's wrong? Tell me something. What if I said you had to stay away from Sylphie for a little while? Huh? Why? What's going on? What, a kidnap him? Don't even ask. I know if I try to explain, you'll just talk your way out of it. Huh? Oh. <laughs> Damn. What was that? What the hell? Ooh. I beat it out of the sword. Oh, shit. Damn. That's Water God style. Could be dead. <sighs> At least it's a wooden sword. Damn. Kidnapped you too? What happened? I'm Rudy Grayrat, and I hope you'll forgive my confusion. You sure you're Paul's kid? <laughs> you seem way too polite. <laughs> my name is Ghislaine. Starting tomorrow, we will be working together. It'll be my pleasure. <laughs> Very nice to meet you. Yeah, let's end the episode. Fuck, dude. Fuck. Man, time emergency meeting. No, other than the day, you know. Um, uh, you know, uh, you know, ha having too much, too much on his hand, you know. Uh, I, I, I just feel like that, you know. Uh, <laughs> I, I really, really don't know. I mean, the dad with two time and a mom, with with the maid, you know, he could at least, you know, uh, you know. Uh, you know, tag me in or something, bro. At least hit me a message. Or, you know, he has to do that. Fuck it up. You no, know, I mean, at least he got two siblings now, I guess. Uh, I'm not sure they're gonna be important. I know the, uh, I know the, I think the red one gonna be the red girl that, um, I seen like in the clip when she had red hair and shit and the uh, red hair, you know, red hair, red hair. So, you know, um, I appreciate that as a point where they get to traveling, like with each other or something like that. Like, I guess, uh, I guess as siblings. Or I don't I don't really know how 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 that work. That's still his siblings. That's his dad. He's just half sister. Yeah, half sisters. And yeah, that's about it. And then you know he got kidnapped. Uh, I I was like I was like surprised like you know because he he should be able to use magic and sword at the same time, but he only used magic because you know he suck at um swords yeah so <laughs> so you know. But yeah, but if you guys want more Josh Carnation, make sure you like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys later.